Hello there, and welcome to another episode of Daily Magic. My name is Slytherin Knight, and I am so happy you could join me. So today's new daily quest is to attack with 30 creatures. Very nice, gives us you know, options of any deck we're going to use. But today we're going to be doing some gruel dinosaurs, because I like this deck. You know, I really do. Uh, it's very simple. Um, nothing has changed since we used it that first day. Big emphasis on getting out your bigger creatures using cards that give you mana, like Ixali's Lore Keeper and Bramble Familiar to help with that. Um, yeah, really, it is just get big Dino out on the field, and that's all it is. <laughs> so yeah, let's go ahead and do some matches. Um, depending on how things play out, we may or may not finish the daily quest today. Um, kind of depends on if we get. Whichever happens first, 20 minutes, running 20 minutes, or finishing the quest. We'll see. Either way, I'm hoping that we have some similar luck to the first time we used this dinosaur deck. Here's to hoping. Okay. Yeah, we got us. Not bad. Sending something out a little easier. And if they decide to, which they do. Unfortunate, but not unexpected. That's fine. To start off with. Actually, I need to get rid of that before they can set up. I'm sorry, I need to get rid of that. Yeah, I don't want I don't want them setting up um, with that. Let's go ahead and go you. Yeah. Uh, Mono Black will definitely be an issue with this deck just because of their easy, easy. And that right there, that. To be completely honest, I kind of want to go ahead and just concede because there's nothing I can do. There's nothing I can do against that, so. But we're gonna try. If they make the mistake of actually attacking, then maybe we'll get something going, but we'll see. This does have a ward too, but they should have It's war Off you go. So yeah, they've made me honest. There's nothing we can do here. So just gonna go. I'm just gonna go ahead and concede. There's not. There's nothing I can do. Um, kind of interesting though. Yeah, good to know that Obliterator pretty much acts as a full-on stall or a full-on wall against us. But they They just had all the removal they needed, and that was a bust. So good to know that that deck is not infallible. Uh, didn't get anywhere towards our attack with 30 because they just kept stonewalling us. But that's fine. We'll hopefully we get a a better matchup for this match. Okay. Um. Yeah, this isn't bad. So I'm going to go ahead and bite the bullet, get rid of you. Don't need that setting up. So that's actually not, not a bad thing. Go ahead and creature. Let's, 
let's see. Can go with, let's do this. Let's get as much on the field as possible. And no need to attack. I guess he'll just block and take it out. That's a fun, unfortunate. Which gets counted. Yeah, I forget they can make a cop. I forget that. Still can't get a I'm one. I'm one man short, I guess. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. just happened. Though unfortunately their flyer here is just is all they need. Though again, that is the power of Itali. You know, if they didn't have that flyer, who knows what could have happened. So, that's okay. We only got four attacks that time, but that's okay. We're going to our next one. That still shows the, the power of Slesnai enchantments. No. 
there's nothing to nothing to attack. Gotta be kidding. Always the dog. Because they don't have anything else. Sorry. I just I do not like that. And again, that comes from being from being an aggro player. Because they have they haven't played any creatures yet. This is a control deck. A, yeah, I just I don't like. It gets frustrating after a while. That can be targeted by green spells. Right? Can be targeted by non green spells, so. Okay, the creature enchantment. We're going to try this. Because this actually has a chance of being really. Tolly Tolly. Are you still activates? Tolly there now. That so that is where Bramble Familiar's uh, fetch quest can be really good. Too bad, too bad that didn't get exiled earlier. They chose not to attack. Okay. I'm just going to attack with it. I mean, we're going to lose next turn, regardless, so... At least we get some. At least we get some um, progress towards our uh, daily quest. And these people are doing nice stuff just to, to end it quickly, which is nice. I, I appreciate that. This is not going how I thought. This is definitely not going how I thought things would. Unfortunately, and sometimes that's just what happens. You, yeah. I'm not gonna be one of those conspiracy theorists and think like, oh, the game knows exactly what deck you're playing, so they're gonna match you up against people that have a counter for you. I'm like, okay, but that doesn't work for everybody, does it? But it's not. Like, I, just, I don't believe that. Yeah. 
sometimes it'd be nice. It, it, I can understand why. Because, yeah, you get on a losing streak, and, it, and it's frustrating. But, but I don't know if there's skill matchmaking in this. I don't know. I'd have to, I'd have to research that. But, I don't know, sometimes it feels like if you're, if you're, if you are playing, like, really well, that you do start seeing harder and harder opponents. Sometimes. I don't know. To the point where, yeah, you have to go on a bit of a losing streak to get back to where you can start winning. Let me guess. Cut down? Another hard removal attack. That's fun. Go for the throat or infernal grasp. to help, but I'm taking the credit when you Ah, one of your friends has Still to removal. leave. It gets frustrating. It does. Oh, I can use its ability. That's fine. I'm like, I'm like, yes. I can't use its ability. You won't be outsmarted. Honestly, getting rid of the Atal is better. Mainly because if I do get something, I don't know there's the See, I could do this, and it would get get rid of it, but I'd have to get rid of six things on my side of the field. I guess I could have used discard that to deal three damage, but it's not like I was going to use that anyway. And force it to go away. Should have just attacked. Don't if they're smart, they'll get rid of the Atali. Yep. Because they can't take me out in that turn, I'm not, I'm not gonna sit. I don't really want to sit sit there and just wait for it. So, but yeah, wanted to get at least one attack for that and see what we could do. But I think we're gonna wrap things up here today. Um, starting to, honestly, I'm starting to get a little frustrated, and when that happens, uh, my my ability to make decent decisions in card play goes down tremendously. So we almost got to half. Um, I also, I also don't like playing frustrated, just because I, I enjoy this game. 
and the more frustrated you get, the, the less it becomes, the less enjoyable it becomes. So yeah, we're going to wrap it up here. If you enjoyed this episode, which I sincerely hope you did, feel free to hit that thumbs up button down below. And if you are new to the channel, hello, welcome, and consider subscribing. I promise not every episode is like this, <laughs> especially with me, um, attitude wise. Either way, <laughs> I'm starting to ramble. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And I will see you all next time.